Good. Train deceleration. Very important. If you can't stop, you can't go. Come on, big man. Come on. Good. Stabilize. Stick that landing. Stabilize. Come on. Good. Drive through. Good. Hold that. That's it. Think about jumping over the box. Got about 36 inches here. Nothing too crazy. Come on. Drive through. Good. Push through. Good. All right. Step down on the other box. Here we go. Come on. Stabilize. Hold it up the top. Hold it. Good. Maintain. Pullovers. Maintain those glutes. Let's get those glutes going with, with uh, dynamic neuromuscular stability with your breathing. Stabilize. Inhale. Good. Hold those glutes up. That's the key here. That a boy. Good. RFD. Let's go. Good. Inhale. Exhale. Maintain that deep core stabilization. Good. You only move well distal if you're anchored proximal. Good. Control. Control. The good old Nordics. Good. Let's really work on four to five count here. Resist that, that eccentric aspect. Come on. Come on. Set. Let's get that deep core stabilization. Good, throw those arms out. Come on, throw those arms out. Come on, working on really getting that good, a little bit of a, a more of a pull down. Good, come on, drive through, one more, come on. Good, maintain, come on. Let's get that toe into dorsiflexion. Let's get that heel to engage. Come on, good, come on, come on. Don't move that chest, just move the arms. Come on, anti-rotation, come on, good. Moving unpredictable loads. Good, trying to get a little bit of activation here. Again, through the, uh, the spiral fascia slings, the fascia cassette, that's all through the trunk region here. Good, as we're maintaining his separation. Again, high low point mobile point is gonna give you better hip separation if you're high mobile point on the back. If you have a low mobile point on your lower back, then those athletes tend to wanna to move together. And in my situation, in my opinion, separation is the key to creating powerful kinetic chain movements. That's it right there.